Hi, Paula Z here at the Florence United Methodist Church out in front of the free lunch door on the fellowship. And I wanted, uh, this is a commercial interlude. I'm letting you all know that we've had a change in the um, free lunch program. We're now passing tickets out the door, looking for volunteers. We've served over 1,300 plus uh, Subway voucher meals since March 17th and continuing. We have uh, gone through a few of our grants already, the Peace Harbor grant, um, the United Way, and we're working our way down through the Salvation Army grant right now. We hope to have funding currently available into spring with no immediate plans to open. Currently, everybody's eligible to get one six inch sub, any sub they like. And we're serving, continuing to serve Tuesdays and Thursdays from 11 to one. They can pick up their tickets here from 1045 to noon. So we are asking if anybody would like to take a shift, you can let me know. Don Gardner has agreed to act as volunteer coordinator. He's been working with us right along, as has Sandy Steckler and Renee across the street, Renee Hansen. So I'm going to take you in and show you a few things inside. We'll be ready to go. So in addition to the new paint, we're also going to be doing a deep clean before we re reopen. Uh, we hope that sometime come spring. In the meantime, you might have observed that we have a lot of sack lunches in preparation in this room in the fellowship where we uh, expect maybe a fallback position or we're going to be distributing them in addition to our subway voucher program. So if you'd like to help us out, uh, so far we have four food volunteers and would like to get some from Florence United Methodist or anybody else who'd like to help us. It'd just be one shift per month or every other month. We'll see depending on how many people sign up. Um, we'll have a lockbox outside the church, access to a bathroom in here, and then uh, passing the tickets out the door. So it, uh, call me, Paula Z, or, and I'll connect you with Don Gardner, our volunteer coordinator. Thank you.